Rants. Number two. Oh, damn. Didn't expect to fall off just then, but I did. Anyway, I'm in the same shirt. That means it was recorded three weeks later when this shirt had been washed like eight times. It's not the same day. No, I didn't record two episodes in one day. No, different day. Right, ranting here, okay? Tinder, do like a, do like a title. Tinder with schools. Don't really know if that's gonna fit. Is that, is that fitting? Or should I go with Tinder with schools? Tinder with schools. Like a, a dramatic thing. Right, there's been this big mass thing with my school recently. Uh, I don't know if this happened in any other schools. You can relate to this. I don't know if this happened in any other schools, but they're like, ooh, them kiddies, you better not go on the tenders, you'll get raped. <laughs> because I think, I think one person in like England recently like got snatched up by an evil man on Tinder because she was she was 15 and she used Tinder and that means she dies. No, right, I'm gonna be totally blunt here. People don't agree with how I talk sometimes because I'm very blunt, but, right? She was an idiot. She was a flipping idiot and that doesn't make the rest of us idiots, okay? Just because she met up with this guy, okay, who she only knew because he chatted on with Tinder, didn't come pre-prepared with anything, nothing for it to protect herself, no phone with like a ready dial on for like anything, anything weird's gonna happen, you know, didn't bring a friend with her, no, he just showed up, that is her fault, alright, that is her being an idiot and her parents not bringing her up right with the constant message in her head, don't be an idiot, we don't have to be told, don't use Tinder, you'll die, you know, <laughs> we don't need to be told that, be told, you know, if you're gonna do this, if you if you have to do, you know, I get why they're like, don't do it at all, just don't bother. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the Tinder thing in a minute, but with the fact we're focusing on Tinder here, the poor company. Um, they 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 say don't use it all, but none of us are gonna do that. It never works. Going don't use Facebook doesn't make the kids use Facebook. We all use Facebook because that's what we do. You know, parents are the only thing stopping kids from yet using Facebook and then it just annoys us and then you're not socialising as much. Literally, in, like everyone at my school uses Facebook, there's no one who doesn't, okay? But at my previous school, it was a lot of bigger schools, there were a few kids who didn't and they were the less popular kids. That's how it works. You taking it away from your child is actually putting them in a lower position. That's what happens here. Because everyone's talking on Facebook and there's chats going on, there's group chats and there's things discussed and there's going out that's discussed on there. Everything is discussed on there, and not be bothered to go for the one kid. You have to be really, really amazing to be the one kid that no one is like. We're well, we talking on this group chat. Remember, all of us to ask that person and reorganize the whole thing at school with this person. No, no one's gonna do that. It's all set up there. You know, everyone's gonna be talking about what happened last night. Like, oh, did you see that? Oh, Daniel. Oh, oh my God. And then you're sitting like. And you're not gonna add anything to it, or she. It's the dumbest thing ever. And the problem that people have, okay, this is turning into a Facebook rant, doesn't matter. Um, the problem people have with Facebook is that, like, teach a kid to be, like, a strong person. Don't be like, no, no, no danger, no, they'll be safe. What when they go in the real world? What when they go in the real world and they get bullied in their job? Because it happens. It happens when you're late. It still happens. People in your job who will bully you. You've got to teach them to be strong and to be an actual person. You can't just hide them from everything in the world. It's like being in the post-apocalyptic universe with the zombies going, Zombies? Zombies don't. You literally just live in this basement because it's warm. Ugh. Okay, back on back onto Tinder. Sorry about that. Right, focusing on one company, Tinder. That's literally it. The mass like email that went out to everyone around the whole school, and you know the, the like service that we had about it when the you know our teacher man stood in the front of us like, oh Tinder, you'll die if you use Tinder. You know that happened. 
there's other things. You just, it's not a social thing. It's not like Facebook where if my mate's on on it, I'm not gonna use it. It's not like that. It is a solo experience of you trying to find other people. So banning Tinder, if you literally took down Tinder, it doesn't do anything. There's hundreds and there's probably thousands of dating websites, dating apps, dating, 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 dating all everywhere. Don't focus on, say, Hey, if you if you actually want to, which is a dumb idea, if you like, don't use it. Warn people, teach them that if you're gonna talk to someone, check who they are. And if you think you know, you probably might not. And be very safe. And teach them why to be very safe. And teach them what happens if you do it. You know, if you just meet up with a random person, teach them bring a you know bring like first time be like, hey, I'm meeting up with some friends. Meet me there. And if they're like, no, I want to meet up just you, me and you, be like for my safety, you know. If you are with that person, if you think that person trusts, you know, if you trust that person, then you can say, no, I wanna meet up with a few mates first, you know, for my safety, if I see you're normal, then you know, we can walk off between the two of us, and that's chill, all right? Then don't go back to their house or something. You know, don't get in a car with them for a while. Let them get, you know, get to know them properly. You know, get them to meet your, you know, get them to meet your parents first. Stuff. Just don't be, make sure your friends know that you're with them and things and what's happening. So, you know, be ready to call someone if something happens or text someone with like a warning message. You've got to prepare people, not try and stop them. You can't just try and force them up. And, you know, and my school's saying like, people don't go on there to date or to meet anyone. It is a prioritized sexual place where people go to have sex. And it's like, no, have you ever act? Has anyone ever actually been on Tinder? <laughs> like, I'm not like an avid user of Tinder. I popped on and gone, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you know, I'm not, I don't use Tinder. But the whole fact of thinking that it's, it's sexually, it's not, there are, there are actual things that are used for that. That's, you know, you know, it's all like, all the adverts like, you know, oh, no messing around all sex and you know that's what that's for you know there's separate places for that there's a time and place for that tinder isn't that tinder is to find people you know to find just a general mate if you want if you want two lions to be like oh i like you you know I just think schools need to realise that you can't stop the kids doing stuff. You can't stop them yourself. You have no power over us. Saying, don't do this, you know, if we're not around your school and you can't check that we're doing it, we're smart kids. We all are. You know, I, I think the schools sometimes forget this, that we are quite intelligent. <laughs> that we can figure out, right, they don't want us to do this, but we want to do it and they can't check if we're doing it to stop us. So, teach people to protect themselves in that situation. You, know, you might wanna say, I'd recommend not using it or, you know, say that, you know, if you want. But don't think that you can just stop people. It's a dumb idea, right? Okay, rant, that was a really long ass rant. Rant over, goodbye.